Hello and welcome. This is how you connect your Shopify store to AppScenic so you can sync and import products and orders automatically from and to your store. Step 1. Go to the integrations page and click on the Shopify logo to add your store. Step 2. A pop-up will open and you will need to complete a few details of your store. In the first field, please enter the name of your store. In the second field, you must enter the URL of your store. This should be the My Shopify type of URL and not the custom domain that you connected to Shopify. If you are not sure how to obtain your My Shopify store link, just go to your Shopify backend, right-click on the home link from the menu and click copy link address. Then go back to AppScenic and paste the link in the second field. Now to fill the last two fields, which are the access token and the API secret key, you must go back to your Shopify store backend and follow the next steps. Firstly, go to your settings page in Shopify. Then click on the apps and sales channels menu link and follow the next instructions. Here you must click on the develop apps button. After that, click on the allow custom app development button and then once again click on the same button that you can see now on the screen. Click on the create an app button and a custom app will be created, which we will use to connect to your store. Just enter a name for your new private app. For example, we will use App Scenic Supplier app as a name, but you can enter any name you like to recognize it more easily later. Click on the Create App button after that. Step 3. Now that your custom private app is created, there are only a few things left that we need to do. Go to the API Credentials tab, and then click on Configure Admin API Scopes. Here we will basically select exactly what kind of permissions to give to your new custom app that we will use to connect and sync with your store. And here we have a text file with all the permissions that you need to add to your custom app. You just need to go through all the permissions from the file one by one and ensure they are enabled in your custom app. So let's copy the first permission from the text file and paste it on the left into the search bar. Once you find it, click on the checkbox to enable the permission. Then you must do the same for all the permissions in the text file. It's pretty easy to do. It's mostly a copy-paste type of task. Let's just fast forward this portion of the video as it's just a repetitive task. Once you are done with the copy-paste and enabling the permissions, please go to the selected tab and ensure you have 13 permissions enabled. If you see 13 permissions in there, then you are good to go to the next step. But before we do that, let's scroll down and click on save and then scroll back up and click on the install app button on the top right of the page. You will be asked one last time to confirm that you want to install this custom app in your store, so please click on the install button. Step 4. Copy the API token and the API secret key to your AppScenic account. We will need a place to temporarily copy our token and secret key, so let's open our text file again. Then click on the reveal token once to see your token. Ensure you copy the token and paste it in your text file right away because this token can be generated and displayed only once. If you lose it, you will have to create another app as you won't be able to retrieve the app token again after this first time reveal. Then do the same with the API secret key. Click on the copy icon and paste it directly into your text file. Now we can finally add the token and the secret key in App Scenic. Once you are done, click on the save button and our platform will instantly connect to your Shopify store. If the connection is successful, you will see that the page refreshes itself, and after that, your Shopify will appear on this page with the status, Connected. Here, you will soon be able to see how many products were imported from your store to AppScenic. Based on how many products you have in your store, it will take from a few minutes and up to one hour to import all your products. Once the products are imported into your account with us, you will be able to see them here on the My Products page. If you ever want to uninstall the app from your store, you can do it by clicking on the Uninstall app in the top right corner. Also, if you go back to your apps page from Shopify settings, you will be able to see your newly created custom app that from this point, we will use to connect to your store and sync the products and orders from our platform. That's all for this video. If you have any questions for us or need any assistance to connect your Shopify store to AppScenic, Please contact us anytime at suppliers at appscenic.com. Thank you for watching.